Today, teach you how to use your iCloud storage instead of your phone storage. So for that, you need to first open your setting. And from insider setting at the top, it's going to show you your Apple ID's name. So my name is Jake Saville. Click on it. But you need to click on the name which is displayed on your screen. Now once you're over here, you can see this option called iCloud. Click on it. And inside iCloud, it's showing you app using iCloud. Click on show all. From over here, you can choose which app you want to be backed up on your iCloud. So as you guys can see, most of my apps are turned on. But let's say you just want your photos to be turned on. You can turn all of these off. Like right beside over here, there's sliders. Just turn these off. Click on delete from iPhone. And what this will do is, all of the data that is stored on your iCloud of that app is going to be removed. You need to keep that in mind as well. Alright, so if I click on words, Safari and I turn off Safari, what is going to happen is every data which is, of Safari that was stored on my iCloud will be deleted. So these are the options. So make sure the app which you want to like you know, be stored on iCloud to be turned on, an iPhone will automatically start backing all those stuff up. You don't have to do it manually, an Apple or like iPhone doesn't provide you option where you can just like you know, manually back all the things up yourself. iPhone will automatically do it. And remember, you also have only 5 gigabytes limited space on iCloud. If you pay for it, you're going to get unlimited space. But if you're using the free version, you're only going to get 5 gigabytes free. So you need to keep that in mind as well. Alright, so don't think iCloud has unlimited storage. So yes, you can do it. You can just turn on the app, which you want to be backed up by coming over here. And you cannot do it yourself. Which means you cannot just go here and say okay. I need this video to be backed up. I need this file to be backed up. It's going to do it automatically. So yeah, you can only choose the app. You cannot choose the things which is inside the app. iCloud will do that for you. So that's how we guys can use iCloud for storage. Instead of your phone storage. So if you guys found our video helpful. Hit the subscribe to our channel. I'll see you guys next time.